everyone. It's a little bit before 10. We're getting on our way. I'm getting ready to get over to 95 and um, drive away. I didn't have any breakfast this morning. I actually forgot. I couldn't wait to get out of this humidity tent. It's so hot. I can't take it. I really can't. So we're headed on out on 95 here in a minute, right up here. And um, I stopped and got me some ice and some apple juice and uh, filled that up so I have something to drink. And uh, I'm just going to be driving. Oh, and I bought me a ham and Swiss cheese sandwich, you know, that's already made because I don't want to have to stop. And I am getting hungry. So, um, this way I can just keep driving. So that's what I'm having for breakfast and maybe lunch. Probably have a late dinner, maybe. So, yes, we are on our way. On our way. We are leaving. And I can tell you something. The humidity is very high today. And it's got that burning muck smell. You know, if anybody knows about Florida, they know exactly what I'm talking about makes you feel like you're in Florida. You know you're in Florida when you smell that muck. <laughs> Maybe other places, but I know Florida. Alrighty. I will check in with you all in a little bit. I have a lot, quite a ways to go before I do anything exciting. <laughs> so I'll see you all in a little bit. Bye. It's about 2 o'clock. Um, I have it out of my little holder. I'm on this road in Georgia. And it's about 70 miles to, um, there's a Class C for sale. It looks too long. Um, it's about seven, I'm about 68 miles from, um, Augusta, Georgia. I mean, now I can go 65. I have my cruise control on. And, uh, yeah. So, I'm getting closer. It's got about 2 o'clock right now. And, um, ran through some rain in uh, Macon, Georgia, I think, some rain. I think that was when I ran in the rain, was Macon, Georgia. And, um, yeah, but it wasn't bad. <laughs> I am tired. I've been up since 3 o'clock, 3.30, so I am getting tired. So I am going to um, drive probably for another hour or so, get closer to, um, either I uh, will get through Augusta, Georgia, or I'll stay on this side of Augusta, Georgia. I don't know. We'll see. We'll play. I'm playing that by ear as I go. I'm not playing enough. I'm just playing by ear. I just stopped and got gas a little while ago. And, um, yeah, I'm tired. I can tell you that. I am tired. So, um, we'll see what happens when I get into town. And when I find a spot, I have my class seat. We'll be boondocking somewhere. <laughs> but we will be. Alrighty, I'll be back with you in a little bit, about an hour or so. Uh, 4.30. I'm putting my hair up because I was getting ready to take a shower. And I left my hair thing down in the car and I didn't want to go up. So I used a garbage bag to tie my hair up. I said, you know what, let me take a pitch. Let me show them the room before I destroy it. <laughs> it's about 4.30. I'm, I'm, a little, I'm a little bit outside of um, Augusta, Georgia. I have about three hours left to travel. Um, I'm going to turn you around and I'm going to show you the room. Comfort Inn Suites. Inn and Suites. I think it's really nice. Look at the bathroom. Nice bathroom. See? Nice shower. I'm fixing to take me a nice hot shower. And then it has over here. I don't know what's in here. I didn't look. Oh, well, that stuff. I only brought little things from the car. I didn't bring a lot because I'm only being here one night. But it has a little kitchen and stuff. Look. I think I can turn a better light on. I don't know. I don't see no more lights. The microwave. I bought Popeye's chicken for dinner. I bought some tenders and red beans and rice. I needed some comfort food. <laughs> a nice size refrigerator. And I have a nice king size bed. See? And I got a TV. I'm up on the fourth floor. Um, it's very clean. It's very nice. I'm very happy with it. I am very tired. <laughs> Let's see if you can see outside. This is outside my room. Ooh, it is bright. And let me tell you, my friends, 
it's hot, but it ain't nothing like Florida. I actually was outside for a little bit and didn't even break a sweat. You feel heat, but it's that humidity kill you. All right. So I am gonna go take a shower. I'm going to go to be in bed soon. I'm gonna, well, I'm gonna be take a shower and get in the bed and watch TV. I need to clean out some of the stuff on my um, camera. I'm gonna upload this video and maybe uh, check out some YouTube. So I haven't checked out YouTube today. So I haven't seen anybody's stuff if they put anything on today. And uh, yeah. Um, I left my sleeping pills down there. I may not need them tonight. I'm so tired. I'm not going to worry about it. I did bring my CPAP machine in, didn't I? Yes, because if you don't use it, if you leave it unplugged more than 24 hours, they call your house. You know that if you wear at least three or four hours a night, it will help you. It's a recording, you know. Because <sighs> when I went on my last trip I went on, they drove them crazy because I didn't use it. But I bought a special table. I didn't buy one, but I had one that I can sit on and sit flat. So hopefully I can use it. And then tonight I'm going to use it in here. So <laughs> make them happy. I am going to go take a shower. I'm going to say good night. And tomorrow's another part of our adventure. So this is the first day of it. We've got 12 more days to go. <laughs> so I will talk to you all tomorrow. Y'all have a great night. Bye.